Hello everyone, you are joining Laura, Neelam, Jay and Olivia at Beyond Beauty where the founder of Beyond Beauty, Neelam, is having fracks. Hello people. Hi. Hi. Hey. Can't look at you right now because I'm actually concentrating but you can ask away any questions. Hi Hadi. Thanks for joining. Hello. Questions, questions will be answered. So today we want to show you how Frax works and what you can expect from the treatment. Hi Deepak. So Laura, good question about the Frax. Yeah. Swelling wise, how long does it take to just the swelling to go down and the process of it? So you're going to see swelling almost immediately after the treatment. You can actually, you will be able to see it from this cheek I'm going to be doing and then when I switch to the other cheek you're going to actually see it. It happens yeah quite quickly swelling can last depending on the skin type and your actual skin itself can last up to two days three days um, that's the norm however it can obviously vary with everybody else depending on how sensitive your skin is it could last a little bit longer but that's normally the time frame another question for you I've got so yeah. frax mm -hmm. when the best time to do it winter always oh, winter yes. you don't want to be exposed to any sun it has to be something that you fit into your diary knowing that full well you're not going to be going anywhere sunny. I mean, holidays in general, when you're going to be exposed to anything like, you know, quite high UV, you don't want to be doing fracks. It's something that is an intense treatment. You don't want to encourage any sort of like pigmentation or anything like that. So, yeah. what's the What's the side effect for it, like for the sun? Like, what, what, what would happen in that process if something did go wrong like that someone say example. if you were to do fracks and then you go and be exposed to a high uv then obviously you're at risk of getting pigmentation or anything like that which is you know fracks one of the things it does is help you remove pigmentation so you don't want to be like encouraging anything extra okay cool. lovely okay so hardy asks is mm -hmm. it painful mm, no <laughs> i think that, that everyone's if everyone's different yeah, everybody's different, so you're going to feel it differently. Some people are going to feel it more than others. That's very, very normal, depending on your pain threshold. But I think you do feel like a tingling sensation. You feel a heat. Yeah. But with the machine itself right now, I don't think you'll be able to hear it right now. Obviously, live, you can hear it like right now, and like me and Neil can hear it. You hear actually like a blower, which is cool air, which is going to help that sort of like heat and redness and everything. Right, okay. Also, there's numbing cream on as well. Yes, very good point. We do apply a numbing cream beforehand, so we do leave that on to just do its magic, and then we'll remove any excess, and then we'll go ahead and continue doing the fraps. Lovely, lovely. So how many sessions do you usually recommend for great results? So normally it's a course of four. You'd be coming in once a month, and then that's what's gonna give you that great results. And Nina, how are you feeling at the moment? Great, nice and relaxed. Quite looking forward to the results afterwards. Great, yeah. it's great. It's all about the results. Yes, the results are amazing. Mm. The skin glows afterwards. You can see the redness as well. Like yeah, you will start forming. You kind of almost see like a grid pattern of forming in the skin, which would obviously then go down. It evens out, and the skin itself would just look quite flushed pinky and obviously you're going to have some swelling you okay Nina? yeah and how long on average does this treatment usually take um normally the first session i always say will give people more time that's purely just because, just in case you do need to stop and start, or just even the explanation and just sort of making everybody just feel comfortable of the treatment. So you're probably looking at like an hour, just under an hour. Great. Well, thank you for joining us, guys. If you have any questions, be sure to fire them away. We'll be happy to answer. Definitely. We're always here for any queries or anything at all. So, Laura, after the treatment... Yeah. What, do, you need, do you need to apply anything on your face? So it's always, if anybody ever knows about IPL treatments or laser treatments, the go-tos are always going to be aloe vera gel, gel based, not cream based, right. and just sunblock, sunblock, sunblock. During the day, you need to be using an SPF of 50. 
we normally there's a whole array of things which we always give you a list of things like do's and don'ts when it comes to doing these treatments what you should be aware of um, most of the time it's actually a lot of it is common sense like as you can see you're not going to do this treatment and then go off to the gym or to the sauna or anything like that so you just have to leave the skin alone so they give it some time to cool down that's it really Hardy has joined us hi Hardy mm -hmm. Redness, Laura. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What would you say would be the best way to kind of um, aftercare, you know, the aftercare process? How would you um, get the skin back to normal after the Frax treatment? Well, to be honest, it's like not necessarily in case of being normal. This is very normal. We're doing Frax and you don't have redness, and that would be abnormal. The whole purpose of Frax is to cause this type of reaction, and that's what's going to give you that sort of like glow afterwards, that tightness. Yes. This is, what, this is what it's there for, basically. So the redness will go down, nothing to be afraid of at all. It's very, very normal. It's just what happens in the first days after doing fracks. That's why, unfortunately, there is a bit of downtime, but with all really great treatments and really great results, there is gonna be a little bit of downtime. Hi, Suki, thanks for joining us. So, Laura, I got a question for you. Yeah. I wanna know the in-depth of fracks. The what, sorry? In-depth. So what is it doing to the skin inside? The, the, skin tissue, the skin layer tissue underneath. Okay, so in basic terms, you're basically breaking down the skin to rebuild it. So you're removing any of the dead skin cells. It's kind of like a, it's resurfacing. It's what it says it is, basically. So you're going to be removing any dead skin tissue. And also what it does is help sort of stimulate your own collagen and elasticity in its skin. Also because you are going to have some removal and you're going to have some sort of flaking afterwards, that's going to be helping with pigmentation. And it also helps tighten and helps rebuild any sort of like tissue in the skin. Hi Sonia, thanks for joining us. <laughs> Everybody's joining now. It's a full house. It's a house. <laughs> Hardy asks, is a patch test done first to ensure it is suitable for your skin? Uh, mm. Normally, not so much with skin with like this treatment. It doesn't. It's not like IPL or laser in the sense where it's like hair removal. We don't normally do skin tests like patch tests and things with this one. We do go through a very strict consultation. We do fill in the forms. We do ask all the medical questions. We make sure that the home care is going to be in place. We make sure that the person knows full well about the downtime, how to schedule it into the person's life. So all of those things are sort of like sorted out beforehand. Great, great, great. And usually you have four treatments of um, Frax. Yes, you do. Yeah, so that's the, that's the best amount of treatments to have for great results, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Awesome. You need to give the skin time to sort of rest in between. You don't want to bombard too much. Yeah. So it's a once-a-month treatment, so you mm -hmm. once a month to let your skin heal. Yeah. And and then you go down again, again and rebuild. Again. Rebuild, yeah. build again. So, yes. Yeah. Exactly. Absolutely. Great. You look so relaxed, it's great. It's. Uh, oh. Do you need some time to lay down? I was going to say. <laughs> that's all what it is. It's nice not to be able to do anything. <laughs> really fast it's really good like mm. once you've had the bigger areas down to the cheeks then it's all pretty much oh, it's all good isn't it's it? all good yeah perfect any more questions guys or also this treatment is really good for acne scarring yes. definitely stretch marks, stretch marks yeah. yes we have don't need to forget about body treatments frax is not just about face yeah so your whole body can be treated too and you have um, sun damage as well you can treat. Mm -hmm.
sleeping. It looks like she's going to sleep. <laughs> so <laughs> relaxed. So guys, any more last questions before we sign off? Remember, this might be having an offer on for Frax as well. So if you purchase three sessions, Take you receive it, it guys. for £456. Yeah. Good um, offers going on. Only month, for the, only for the month of January. So make sure you take advantage. Yeah. Last thing anybody wants to know. Yeah. I'm gonna be signing off soon. I think Needham is thoroughly going to sleep. <laughs> I'm thoroughly enjoying it. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you for tuning in. And yeah. We hope to see you soon again. Be sure to, su to subscribe to our live videos so you'll be the first to know when we come online. And thank you again for tuning in. We'll see you later. Bye guys. Bye. Bye.